What's more likely? Never say never, but never. Thank you very much. Let's go. Go for it, Chris Brock. Hey, what's up, guys? <laughs> How's it going? Um, this is not a text exchange like back in the day. <laughs> Got it. Okay. Is that a callback? Yes, is that a callback? Call call yeah. Hey, Thank big you. game in Ohio, Rich, this weekend. <laughs> Patriots Browns. Yes. Mm-hmm. Huge game. I think we're going to see a, a lot of running of the football this week. Nick Chubb, your NFL leader in rushing yards. And Ramondre Stevenson had a huge week last week. Who has more rushing yards, Nick Chubb or Ramondre Stevenson? Ramondre had 161 last week. Nick Chubb's high for the year is 141 in week one. I'll go with Ramondre. I'll go with Ramondre uh, Stevenson. I'll do it. What do you think? You, you look at me like I'm crazy? Yeah, I don't go think on, it's going to be. Is that a Georgia Bulldog situation? No, I think. <laughs> Is that what's happening here? Yeah. Oh. yeah. Yes. you looked at me like I'm crazy. Hey, after Gurley, you had to become a chubby girl. That was the whole, <laughs> that was how it worked. I know. Uh, so I'm still a huge Nick Chubb fan, uh-huh. uh, but I actually think it's going to be more of a, a passing game because I think Zappy is the future. Oh, Stop love it. it. Way to mix it up, Sarah Stop Tiana. It. Stop no, it. Here's why. Here's why I'm going with my fan. Okay. And this is the line that um, Brian Billick, when he was on this program multiple times, hates the most. <laughs> It's that what will Bill Belichick, he always takes away the one thing Mm -hmm. you love the most. And he always would be like, no other coach decides to do that. Only Belichick is the one who takes away your most prized weapon. I think he's going to figure out how to stop this run. And he's going to say, I know Jacoby Brissett. Let's have him try to beat me with with Amari Cooper and Donovan Peoples-Jones. And (laughs) knowing it's going to be a pass-happy game because Mm -hmm. it's... Zappy happy yeah. is basically what you're saying. <laughs> Zappy you happy. I love it. I do love Zappy. Uh huh. All right, let's go down uh, to Miami, Rich, a yes. team that's not top ten worthy in your mind, and then a team that is, even though they have a worse record. Receiver to haul in a hundred yards and a touchdown: Justin Jefferson or Tyreek Hill? I'll go Justin Jefferson. What about you? Yeah, I take Justin Jefferson all the way. Tyreek I mean, was in a walking boot he's this in week. a walking boot. And who's throwing to him? That's always the question. Walking boot is fashion now. Nike made some walking boot. Yeah, and and he's in a walking boot limping around ping pong table shopping. That's not a good idea. I'll take Justin (laughs) Jefferson. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to cross my fingers. It is Justin Jefferson because I have him and Kirk Cousins on my fantasy team. Wait a minute. What? Yeah. That's the handcuff you have together? uh, I do have them together, yeah, which is double points. (laughs) And it's been working. It worked out three out of the five weeks so far. Kirk Cousins points in your league are worth two? (laughs) (laughs) Interesting. (laughs) Interesting league. No crazier league than this guy's league, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You had to leave the house for that nonsense. I always leave the house. Yeah. Yeah. I chose to leave the house. (laughs) Because you're a smart, smart person. Thank you. Yeah. What else you got over there, Chris? Okay. uh, I didn't realize we're doing this with Sarah here, so this works out. (laughs) Um, Two and three home dog to Uh pull off an upset. Falcons? Falcons or Seahawks? You want to take this one? Well, I mean, I think I really always think, take the Falcons. But, but that's just fandom. Like you got to put your real, your real thinking but, cap on. But here. I wouldn't remove your fandom from the equation. No, but the Falcons are five and zero this year against the spread. So mm-hmm. we are we play our games a lot closer. And mm-hmm. obviously, like Seattle just lost a running back, and we've been great against the pass, mm-hmm. even though we just traded Deion Jones. So like. I, I definitely take the Falcons at home. I think we play better at home too. All right, uh, I'll just for the uh, for the you know what's and get. I just think the 49ers have turned into the proverbial team that you don't want to face from last year. I think they're back, so I think that that's going to be a very difficult. <laughs> but the 49ers for you. always lose games they're supposed to win, and they win games they're supposed to lose. Well, last week was one of them, don't you think? They were supposed to lose that one last week. I guess it was just so bad with Matt Rule and, and um, Which is why Baker Mayfield. Look, I, they I, won. I, I like Geno. Cooking. They're supposed to win this week against the Falcons, which is why they'll lose. Geno's a home dog? Geno, home dog. Really? Field goal. They keep on disrespecting Geno Smith. Let him just oh. keep on winning Players of the Month awards, and then we'll just have them try to focus. <laughs> All right. I'll take Seattle in that one. I think okay. Seattle does go 3-3. Three and three. I'm probably going to really? take Seattle in the game day oh, morning pool. Absolutely. Tune in Sunday. What else you got, Chris? Uh, the Goats have kind of struggled so far this year uh, throwing the football, so Goat quarterback to throw more TD passes, Rodgers or Brady. Brady only has one game this year with multiple TDs. Rodgers has thrown two four weeks in a row. What do you think, Sarah? Uh, let's see. Well, like. You got. You got Brady's Brady. In, Brady's, Brady's in, in Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh. Yep. And Rogers. But Brady has an injury to okay. his finger. Mm-hmm. Um, I think it's the ring finger. I'm not sure. But oh, I'm. He does have an injury. Did you really just? You just went there. 
Did you really just go? <laughs> yeah. That was very, that was very <laughs> subtle. Okay. Thank you. Um, <laughs> I see what you did. Oh, wow. So I would, I would technically say Rogers, just because Brady has an injury. And I will go Tom Brady. <laughs> yes. Because Aaron Rodgers is going to be looking up. And he's going to be seeing Sauce Gardner. No. Yep. Sauce. He's going to see Sauce yeah. on Lazard, and he's going to look at Romeo Dobbs, and Dobbs is going to not be in the wrong spot, and Romeo he's going to hand it off, probably, and there's yeah. Quinn and Williams in his backfield, and he'll be like, what the hell is happening here? And I will say the Jets are happening. Oh, That's what I will say. R-E-L-A-X? No. <laughs> J-E-T-S. All right, let's, let's move on. Yes! Let's move on. AFC, no- AFC North Do team it. to get a road win. Mm. Bengals or Ravens? Oh, I'll go Bengals. Joe Burrow's not going back to the Superdome and losing that game. Really? He's going to go back in that spot? Mr. LSU tough, Tiger? Tough place to play, Come man. on now. I tough know place it's a to tough They're place not to cheering play. for it's you. Early. It's an early game, noon kickoff, so the folks there won't have to, not a lot of swing oil. Come on now. <laughs> have you been to New Orleans? I know. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to go Ravens in, the, in, in uh, New Jersey? They're taking on the Giants. I mean, the I Martindale just. The Martindale revenge game. I just feel like the Giants are a real team. Like, yes. they are very good. And yes. I think their defense is what keeps them in the game. Yes. So I would take, I I think the Giants would beat the race. So okay. I, I will take, Joe Burrow. I'm going with oh, Joe Burrow. Back down. up. There Joe we Burrow. go. Joe Burrow. I mean, he, that's where you want to point to the ring finger. He's pointing <laughs> yeah. the ring finger in those, in, around, around those parts. All right. Come we, on. we got another uh, thrilling uh, AFC South battle. Jaguars, Colts, could be 9-6. <laughs> Sell it, Chris. Uh, how about what's more likely? Uh, Trevor Lawrence gets his third career 300-yard passing game, or Jonathan Taylor back this week goes off 150 and a touchdown? Oh, man. I don't oh. remember. How good are the Jaguars against the rush? I can't remember. They're, well, they pretty, just, they're pretty stout. They're they, better than you know, not. They played a real craptastic game last week. I mean, you, that's one of those, again, your what's more likely is where I think neither are likely. <laughs> yeah. is, that's the issue. Is sometimes you go so that's off about, the charts here. I just wanted to talk about this game. I know you want to talk about this game. I, I and, and this is a rematch of the shutout that occurred in week two, turning right around here. Uh, I'll go Jonathan Taylor. I'll say that's what's, that's more likely here. Yeah, I think that I think I agree with you on that. I, I would take Jonathan I Taylor. Right. I'm playing against <laughs> Christian Kirk this week. What else? Uh, all right, let's hit the two big games. Uh, biggest something's got to give. Okay, something's got to give. The By the way, for the radio audience, I'm Chris went air quote. I'm quoting. Quote. I'm quoting. Air quote. You know that's the thing is like, when you're gonna What's match up your like quotes. You're like, hey, some. Does right. he air quote at home? Oh yeah. Does he really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Air quote oh, guy. okay. Uh, the Bills' second half defense. You know they've only given up seven points in the second half this year. Or Kelsey's TD barrage. He has four straight games against the Bills with a touchdown. I, I will go. Can I say both? <laughs> Bills have given only seven second half points. And can't I, say both, TJ. All right. So, all right. <laughs> And this is Kelsey scoring a touchdown in the second half? No, no, this is just Kelsey against the Bills. He scored four games in a row. So what 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 gives? Does Kelsey get shut out? Or I'll say the, Kelsey gets or shut out. Or do the Bills out. finally give up second half? Points? I'm just as long as I'm pick, pissing off Chiefs Nation with my Raiders pick. Stay consistent. I think the Chiefs are a second half team, so I would say that the, the Bills, Bills end up down. giving up points in the second half because the Chiefs are stronger in the How second half. How about that the Bills will give up more second half points than normal and Kelsey won't go off? How about that? Again, just <laughs> straddle on the fence. All right, last so one. Steve Mariucci and Last me. one. More combined yards. Zeke and Pollard on the ground. A.J. Brown, Devontae Smith in the air. A.J. and Devontae in the air. Yeah, for sure, A.J. and Devontae. I think this is an Eagles game, guys. Yeah. I think, yes. Yeah. The Eagles are no joke. I think Ooh, the Eagles are no Eagles joke, game. and I think that uh, Cooper Rush has not seen a defense like this, and I think they're going to stop the rush on the way to the pass, and it's going to be a potentially long night, and the Cowboys will wind up saying, well, how's Dak's hand? That's Jalen, the way I think Jalen Hurts go. hasn't seen a defense like That's this. That's what yeah. I'm seeing what is more likely. Yeah, I mean, I think the Eagles have uh, the advantage because they have Jordan Davis. Nicely I'm a big done. fan of. Oh, and well, don't forget Nicobe, right? Yeah, Nicobe's there. Yeah, he th- yeah, I don't think he starts, but he plays no, very well when he's in there. Okay. He plays very well when he's She's in going there. Georgia Bulldog on us. Is, <laughs> Always. That, is that your what's more likely? That's right it. There? What's more likely? Okay, there Rap. you go, ladies, ladies and gentlemen. Good job, Christopher.